Hey guys, hey guys, me Poppy Rain here. So you know how I've been doing a video series where I'm looking for clothes nine months and ten, size ten for the big boy and nine months for a little man. Well, we're going to do a twist on this series today. We're Not only are we going to do that, but we're going to be getting rid of stuff from A to Z of the alphabet. So let's see how much stuff we can get rid of. Because little man's sleeping. Depending on what time he gets up, I might go to Walmart before I get daddy. I might wait till after daddy's done. Because so I got to get this whole one side of the basement cleaned up. So, holy crap, it's cold down here because it's freezing outside. So, I'm going to go through and try and get rid of things A to Z. So, I'm going to actually work on both sides. So, I have to start my bin of stuff that we're keeping that's too small. So I have a shoe over here that needs a home. But yeah, A to Z. So I don't know if we'll find all the letters of the alphabet. Right now, because I don't have a lot of A's, I don't think. Okay. So here's our bag. We're putting our donations in and we'll see what we can find. So these can get thrown over there right now. They're in my way. They just cleared off this spot. So I'm going to be working on, I do have a small pile over here that I need to go through. I'm going to be working on this stuff, this stuff, and this stuff. So, right now we have these. These are nine months. These can go upstairs. Those are going to go in the upstairs pile. These are 4T, so I gotta make a pile of stuff to go in one of these bins once they're filled. I think the stuff that we're going to take upstairs is gonna go in here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull from this box, this box, and then something over here. So I have this box right here that I'm gonna use. Actually, I'm going to save this box for something else. I might dump this box out that's sitting over here. So, here's item number one we're getting rid of. I need to make a list somewhere. For every letter of the alphabet. I wish I had something I could write on down here. Let me see if I can find something to write on because I have a Sharpie right here. So I can check off. Yeah, I'll write on the... Uh, we'll write on this envelope, so. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M. Okay, so for D, we're getting rid of a Disney coloring book. I got this off a of free site. I'm not going to use it. It's only got like this much colored in it. So I'm going to get rid of it. So that's A, or that's D. So that came from that pile. I don't know what this goes to, but I really like this. It's a little clown outfit, so we're going to keep that. It's going to go in... Uh, 
Where did I put that little box? This is going to be stuff for keeping that's not closed because all the clothes are going to go in a box together. All the clothes that are where that are too big for Gabe. Okay. We've got a little shirt that's a 3T. So that's going to go on the floor for now. Let's see, this shirt says, I can only do things one way, like a boss. This is gonna go upstairs for a big man, for our eldest. Two teeth. Let's see, we have these pants, these are a size six. So those can go upstairs for our middle list. We have a reborn outfit. I don't do 24 month onesies. So for O, we're gonna get rid of a onesie. Because once they start potty training, onesies are terrible. Eighteen months. We have three to six month pants that are that we're saving for the next baby or reborn or whatever the case may be. Twenty-four months, too small, or too big. Eighteen months, too big. A troll doll. We're not getting rid of any trolls yet until I get them all in one place. You can separate out duplicates. We have the miracle of the mitzvah moose. I am not Jewish, but if I ever switched religions, I would become Jewish. I got this on sale from Michaels with um, with the mitzvah moose. So we're gonna keep that. Nine to 12 months, that's going upstairs. Twelve months. This picture, I like it, but I don't think I'm going to actually do anything with it. So for P, we're getting rid of picture. I forgot to write down the rest of the T U V the rest of the alphabet. So right now we got rid of a Disney coloring book for D, a onesie for O, and a picture for P. I got this off a curb alert. Looks like it'll be for the older one. That looks like it'll fit the older child. Maybe possibly me. So that's going upstairs. 12 months, too small or too big. We have this adorable. What's her name? Annie doll. I got her. I don't remember where I got her. I don't think I paid for her. I think maybe the clothing bank. But she's worth quite a bit of money. So I am going to keep her. Ain't no mama like the one I got. A newborn onesie. We're going to keep that for the next baby. Or for reborn, I think, probably. Two. Mm 
these are kind of stained so I don't know what I want to put these are R for rooster all right we're gonna do R for rooster rooster overalls they're stained we have a villainous valentine's the first one I ever got I think I have one more or two this is from GameStop I usually go to GameStop more for items not so much games I do occasionally go for games this box is almost full so I might have to find a new box to put stuff in that I'm keeping that's not closed that are too big for games Let's see. three teeth A lot of these clothes were clothes for my nephews, so they're like 18 months and up. More 18 months. We have Born This Way. This does need to be washed. It is dirty. Um... I got this, so V made me buy this at the state fair because she got one for her. She she had me buy her one that was her souvenir, so she had she made me buy that one that was hanging on the back seat of Rona for the longest time. Three T. These I think are eighteen months. 3D. See, this looks cool. I really like this outfit. 18 months. I'm not getting ready rid of any clothes for seasons except for nine month summer clothes. We have this little bracelet. It's a little bracelet chain first that I bought off of. She and I think I hate it. I don't use it. So we're going to do S for strawberry. Because B I can eat. Because I'm going to save. I'm not going to do like B. Because I can come up with a thousand things for B. I was gonna, I'm not going to do B for bracelet. S for snap bracelet or S for strawberry. I'm not going to do B for bracelet. Because like I said. I can come up with a thousand things for that. Because baby items. Is the majority of what I'm going through right now. Four T, and I think a lot of this bag over here was clothes from my middle list that he outgrew. Because honestly, if the clothes from the previous child, so if the clothes from the previous child are still usable and still in decent condition, we just hand them down to the next child. The only plus side of having the same gender kids, all same gender kids. Other than that, there's nothing good about it. Steel wool. I'm going to need that at some point for my swords. So we're going to keep that. This I know is... I bought this for Gabe from Walmart. For Halloween. I remember buying him that. That was his first Halloween sweatshirt. Shorts. Too big for my Gabert. So like I said, this is stuff that's too big for the... Too small for Corbin and Grayson, for the my stepkids, too big for little man. And anything that's too small for little man or as reborns are not going together, but I'm trying to, so that way when I can, when I need the next size clothes, I can just grab the, I can say, oh, here's a whole box of clothes and just grab those and take them. Okay. Where, I don't remember where I got this. If I got this off a of curb alert, yeah, I think I got this. Possibly, I don't remember if I got this at Pride or if I got this at a off a of curb alert. But we're gonna keep this my gay pride flag because I don't think I got that one from the state fair. Okay. I'm 
like I said, there are some sixes down here. From Big Man. So, and we have a pair of shorts, which are four. So if you're wondering why there's sixes down here, because Grayson wasn't ready for sixes and Corbin had outgrew them and I didn't really have space to store them up there. 24 months. So far, all of this is a no-go. Most of these clothes are too big, 18 months. I haven't really found much to go upstairs yet. Okay, here's a purse I thrifted. I dubbed this my doubloon purse. I use this for pirate cosplay or like steampunk, anything like that. I think I did, I can't remember if I used this one for the run fair. I don't think I did, but I do keep that for that. So I am going to transfer this. Now, I'm gonna pile up stuff that's safe to go up there. Okay. Now I need to find another vessel to put all the stuff that I'm keeping in. Which I don't think, I have one down here. Mm. I'll dump out this bag. Okay, this is for all the stuff I'm keeping that is not close or too big. Okay, should be a doubloon purse. For one of my Reborns. And then when one of these boxes is empty, this tub or this box, I'll put these clothes in there that I'm keeping. 2T. I kind of want to do this floor now too. 18 months. What is this? Ooh, nine months. That can go in the bin to go upstairs. We have this purse that I use for dressing up. This is actually the purse from my prom. But honestly, I don't dress up enough. I don't use it. So, what do I want to call this? I can use this for B for black bag or beaded bag. I can't use this for dress purse because I already did that. I can't use P for purse because I already did. Wait, no, did I not use P? P I did. So I have A, B, C, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, Q, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z left. So F for fancy purse. We're going to do, we're going to stretch it and make it a fancy purse. We're going to get rid of that. I've literally had this since 2011. Can't hold on to stuff forever now, can I? A 2T. Twenty-four months. It's not a onesie. Let's see what's over here. Nine month little pants. Those can go upstairs. That's really what he needs is pants. Twelve month shorts. Okay. We have this. So there used to be this local thrift store in this little town, maybe about 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes from my dad's house. Um it's a little further from here. But it doesn't exist anymore. It was connected. It was like a building. So in the so it was like in this little development. There was like a little ice cream stand. 
ice cream little shack thing, a fire station for that town, the town's fire station, then this big building that was this little thrift store on one side and then Dollar General on the other side. This I got and love because it says Pace. Which, don't ask me the translation. I can't remember what it means. But all I remember is that Pace is Italian. And my mom's Italian, so I thought that super cool. My Italian gay pride flag. Okay. These are cute little woody pajamas. I think these were size four. Yeah, these were ones that my... A lot of the clothes that are size fours and threes were from my... A girl that I go to doubt club with that actually graduated with my brother. From her two kids. She gave us a bunch of her old clothes for our kids. 18 months. Let's see, what's this? Another nine month? Nope, 12 months. First thing out of that pile that has not been nine months or like a bigger thing. Or too small. 12 months. Okay, we have these pens. They're watercolor pencils. I got them when I got that coloring book from Disney. The Disney coloring book. And actually it was ironic because Kelsey ended up knowing the lady. Because she lived diagonally across from her mom and we had to actually stop at her mom's to take her dog out because she was dog sitting at the time so i am going to keep those because i can use those for lots of different things not just coloring in a coloring book this one i'm pretty sure is one that's too small yep one of his newborn onesies my brother got him most of the baby Yoda stuff that was on my wish list my brother's super nerdy like not in that way but like computer nerdy Another shirt from what I'm assuming is my nephews. I don't know. I get these clothes from everywhere. I get them from Once Upon a Child. Which I might stop over there later. Once Upon a Child in Walmart. Once Upon a Child. Thrift stores. Free groups. Curb alerts. Hand-me-downs from my nephews. Um, things that parents donate at work. Oh, how cute is that? Maybe he'll wear that to daycare on Monday. That's cute. Oh, wait, I think I just grabbed him that pile. Okay. 18 months. We have my Donna Sharp bag. I don't know. I'm debate. I'm torn between these. I actually got these from a little seller. It's like a restaurant that has a furniture store and then a little like gift shop. And I, when Vera Bradley was big, I had these because I don't like Vera Bradley. And I don't know. This one, I think, this was the one I bought. The other one was the one I thrifted. And I just don't know how I feel about it. Like, am I really going to use it? I used to use it. When I did dance class, or when I did Zumba, it would literally just fit my spare shoes in there, and a water bottle. Then I could throw, like, my keys and stuff in there. So, I'm going to put this in a maybe pile, because I don't know if I'm going to keep it or get rid of it. I can't decide. I don't know why I kept this. I really don't like camo. Maybe because it's Columbia, but I, because I do love a good Columbia piece. Because, you know, I live in an outdoorsy family. My dad and my brother are very outdoorsy. My dad more so than my brother and my sister-in-law. Mom's not really outdoorsy, but. So, I don't know, but honestly, I think I'm not going to be too picky and keep it because it's in good condition. Just because we don't have a lot of clothes. Once he gets past 18 months is where it starts to go downhill for clothes from there. So, most of it's whatever we have left over from the big kids. So, unless it's 24-month onesies, because I cannot do onesies and potty training. They're so frustrating. Working at a daycare, if you know, you know. 
18 months. She actually does. We do have this down here somewhere in a smaller size, too, that we saved. Because I'm a big Dr. Seuss fan. We loved Dr. Seuss growing up when I was a kid. I know a lot of controversy around Dr. Seuss. And all the places you'll go is one of my favorites. My absolute all-time favorite is Marvin King Mooney, Please Go Now. Then Miguel Gets Pool. This is super cute. A little nine-month dinosaur top that's going in the upstairs pile. 12-month camp. Okay. Next, we have another Donna Sharp bag. This is the one I thrifted. I'm just... And like I said, I really don't love this colorway. Again, I used it as a dance bag. It was great for what it was when I needed it, but now that I don't do zoom on everything, I'm let's see. What do I want to put this as? I can either do B for bag. I guess I'm gonna count it as B for bag. I'm getting rid of this bag. attachment to it mm. this one i'm pretty sure came from my nephews oh no this is 9 to 12 months so this is going in the upstairs pile okay that's like the, one of the first things i pulled out from that section um yeah some of these are inside out because if i didn't need them right away i didn't really care which got lazy 2t okay this is stained so we're gonna get rid of this got like some weird yellowing stains on it so I did so I don't know this can just be one of those I guess items that doesn't have a letter because it doesn't fit with a there's nothing a about it oh no crocodile you can go under C for crocodile crocodile footy PJs because, so I've done, so I have A, E, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, Q, T, U, V, W, X, and Y left on this journey. If I do find extra stuff, I find extra stuff. But for right now, those are the only ones I'm going through. Those are the main ones I'm concerned about. I have to find those letters before I end this challenge. 18 months. Cute, though. We have my flask bag. I thrifted this. I use this as another pirate bag or sometimes like steampunk, anything like that. So that's a keep. Very unique, very different. Got that actually from Salvation Army by my house. Two T little shorts. Nobody can wear those yet. 18 months. I might have to get rid of 18 month onesies because he'll probably be in 18 months by the time he starts potty training. Nine month little vest. That can stay. This Sam mask that got destroyed in the wash because daddy wasn't supposed to wash it. So that's going to go under M for mask. I paid 50 cents for the Sam costume. So excited about it. Daddy ruined it in the wash. Okay. This bag is old and seen better days. This, I actually, it came with something, I think. But I used to use it to, like, store. So, like, my Apple Watch, my bracelet. My glasses are a little too long for this. But any jewelry I had on when I go swimming or when I go to the... Like, any time I go swimming or somewhere where I need to take my jewelry off and I have, like, a wet bag, pretty much. But, I haven't used this in several years, so I'm going to get rid of that. I don't even know. I mean, technically, it's a change purse. I'm going to do it as a W for wallet. But we're going to get rid of that because it's stained and gross. And I've had it for 
since before I graduated high school. Ooh, nine month score for Gabe. And just so you guys know, if you haven't seen Gabe recently, um, since the last video is where I was talking about the whole issue that was occurring here in January, until further notice, Gabe will not be posted on social media. Well, sorry, on Facebook. On my videos. None of the kids will. Here's Puma pants. We're going to keep those. Now, I get a lot of these clothes at work either when we have an overflow of extra clothes that we don't need. When we have clothes that parents donate that we can't use. When, like, we had a family that had a house fire. They left half a room full of stuff we got to take whatever we wanted at that by the end of it um we had a parent that worked at salvation army she would bring us a lot of the clothes that were being thrown out that she thought were worth saving so i got a bunch of clothes from that it's a super cute little 12 month jacket so i can get a bunch of clothes from that 18 months My first ever piece of Betsy Johnson. My mom bought me this. I mean, I don't know. I'm like torn because it does have some cat scratches on it. it does have a little like stuff right there. I could probably clean it up though. So I think for now I'll keep it. It's got like cat markings in the back. This is my first ever piece of Betsy Johnson. And I'm like, this is super cute. I've always wanted a bag like this. And I'm like, it's Betsy Johnson. That's why. I'm... She is one of my favorite designers of all times. Love that. Got that as a gift. Christmas gift for my mom. So I think I will keep that. Okay. 3T. Nobody can wear it yet. 18 months. Going in the pile. Little brother. I don't usually do little brother, little sister. I, mean, I don't have any girls, but little brother stuff. I don't feel the need to do little brother, big brother, unless I'm making an announcement of some sort. But, anywho, don't have a lot of nine month clothes for him, so can't be picky, so we're keeping it. I saw this hair and I was like, what the heck is this? I don't remember where I got this troll, but it's Branch from Dreamless Trolls, so I'm keeping it because it's a troll and I'm not getting rid of any trolls until I officially have them all in one spot and can sit down and separate them out by types of trolls and then go through and sort all the duplicates. This bag. Love this bag. It's an Alice in Wonderland bag. It's definitely seen better days, I feel like. Kind of chewed up and ripped right there. I don't know that I'm ever going to use it again. I don't have the strap for it anymore. So I believe the strap broke. Got something sticky on it. I don't really know. This is from, I think, Wish. When I'm still buying on Wish. So, A for Alice in Wonderland bag. Bye-bye. As much as I love it, it's not doing it for me anymore. I'm trying to only keep, like, a, a few like smaller bags pretty much trying to keep like mini backpacks costume bags Co oh, okay so i'm trying to keep cosplay bags mini backpacks travel luggage and bags i can use for work and then like reusable grocery bags other than that try to get rid of the majority of everything else that i'm not going to use of all of their bags. This is super cute. Little Spooderman 2T sweater. Because I'm a mom. I don't... It's too hard to carry a purse. I'll keep a few crossbodies, but 18 months. Let's see. Nine month little panty pants. Go in the upstairs bin. We have... My thrifted friend, Gobo. If you're a 90s kid and you know Fraggle Rock, you know. 
That's a big Fraggle Rock and Muppets Kid. Gobo is 110% staying. Okay. This bag, it's got like two sides to it. It's, I think from middle school. I don't even know what brand this is. I want to, it looks kind of like mud, but I don't think it is mud. Does it tell me a brand on the tag? Does not tell me a brand. But it's old, it's faded, it's stained. It's Meditate. I, God, I can't remember the last time I've used this thing. It's seen better days, folks. It does not fit. Yeah, I don't think it fits anything in here. So, it's not counting for that. It's just counting as, I don't want it, I don't want it anymore. Mm. Pants for one of my Reborns. I keep all the girl Reborn clothes just because I don't have a lot. Twenty-four month shorts. Eighteen twenty-four month pants. Let's see where are these? These can go upstairs. These are size six pants. Woohoo! Making my way downtown, walking homebound. Mm. Once upon a time, when I was a little, I was obsessed with shimmer and shine. Ew, this has some like white sticky stuff on it. I don't know. It's like falling apart. I thrifted it. We can get rid of shimmer and shine. I don't know if that fits in any category. I don't think it does. Shimmer and shine can go. It's gross. It's old. This is badly stained onesie. See you later, alligator. That can go. I don't have anything. That doesn't even have a category for it. 18 months. Let's see. Three to six months. Those can be saved for reborn or next baby. Uh, we have a gnome. I believe I thrifted him. I guess I'm going to keep... I'm not going to like be obsessed with collecting gnomes, but I am going to keep the gnomes I have. I think that's what I think I'm going to do as far as gnomes go. Okay. We have Mr. Holden, one of my reborn boys. He's forever staying. I bought him off a of Facebook group. Most of my reborns are off a of Facebook group. <sighs> Another reborn girl piece. Cool beyond my ears. Cool, it's nine months. We can keep it. Three to six months, I'm pretty sure those are girl pants. Ugh. One of my favorite bigger trolls. Love him. Don't remember where he came from. But, like I said, all trolls are staying. Mm. This is vile. My Betsy Johnson lunchbox. This is going for L. Um, this needs so much help. I don't use it anymore. I can't remember the last time I used a lunchbox. I just throw my lunch in my backpack. And then if it, and then there's a fridge in every room except for school age. And there's two in the kitchen, so this can go. I got this off of Poshmark, I believe, is where I got that from. Mm-mm. 
That's gross. I don't even want to clean it. Someone else can deal with it. Maybe somebody else is probably dirty tea. And don't get mad at me for getting rid of stuff that's like not in best condition because people have done that to me all the time. Giving me, like, I had a pile of clothes that actually came from. So, Daddy kind of knew the ki the guy. I actually went to school with his sister. She was one of my arch enemy, one of my two arch enemies. His little, his little less sister. His, and then I think it was his middle sister or his older sister. His oldest sister. I can't remember. My brother actually went to prom with. And the clothes they gave me were so gross. I had to wash them twice to get them clean. So don't come at me. Little pants that I don't think Gabe ever got to wear. Twelve months. This backpack I forgot existed. How funny is this? My little bunny bag. I think I got this off of... I want to say either Shein or Wish. I don't even remember, but I forgot I even had this thing. Oh my goodness. Yes, please. Now I have to find an excuse to start carrying that around. That's too funny. And this bag is full, so I'm going to remove it. Okay. Now I need to find another vessel to put stuff in that I'm keeping. So I'm thinking maybe this bag. Okay. So, because that bag, that box will be empty too, so I can use that now. Whoa. Forty. Fourteen, sixteen. Those are way too big. Three to six months little puppy dog jammies. We're gonna keep those for the next baby. My '90s tubble baby that I thrifted. I had the Caucasian one as a kid, and I had the little mini one. One of the little mini ones. I did not have this one as a kid, but very nostalgic. I used to spend hours trying to get that thing to stand up. I'd be so mad if I couldn't get her to stand on her head. These are stained. So, Jamma Top. I'm just going to say Jamma Top. That can go. And we have almost a full bag already. I mean, I think because it's a lot of bigger stuff. I think that's part of the reason why. Four T. These are probably ones that I was saving. Yep, three to six months. My Mr. Alien. I got him second hand off a group on Facebook. He's from Ash and Drake. But I absolutely love him. That's a big head. I don't think I really want to put him in there. I want to wait till this box is emptied. Which will be here. Now. There's some other random things that need to go. Most of that's garbage over there. You can just go in the garbage. We have Traxon's little ornament that he made me my his first Christmas. Let's see. 
sporty pants. Honestly, these like sport type shirts don't fit tracks very well, so we're gonna get rid of that. So I don't know if I have you know it I don't know if I have anything that'll go with that. What are these? Three to six month little panty pants. pants we have this button it says perfect we get out here i'm gonna do anything with that so got the soft curve alert what do i want to i don't think i need g h i k q t u v x and y so that doesn't go with any of the categories Four T shorts. Ugh. I really want to go eat lunch soon. This is nine months. Pampers, what size are these? I don't know why this is down here. This is a size two. That can go in the pile to go upstairs. Not sure why I have a size 2 down here, except the size he's currently in. 12 months. Right now I'm still putting the smaller items in this bag and then putting all the bigger items in that bag. Let's see. Two. We've got one of my Alien Remix. This is Darla. Right? That's her name? I can't remember where I got that. I think the five below. Such easy where I get those. Twelve months. Four months. Two T. Nine months. I can go upstairs. <sighs> that big bag is about halfway done. That's a little over half, and that's a little over half. 12 months. 12 months. A size 1 diaper that we're going to save, because diapers never expire or go bad. Eighteen months. Loved this little hat on my child. One of my favorite clothing pieces, one of my top five favorite clothing pieces ever for him. He wore that for Easter, I believe, and Thanksgiving last year. 2T. Nemo! To the Nemo! To the Nemo! We love a good Alien Remix. I don't like the plushies. Gabe actually has the plushie to that one. I didn't, I didn't have the heart to get rid of that after I made Daddy buy it for me. 18 months. Hey, 9 months. Sweet, sweet, sweet. 24 months.
Sometimes he works, sometimes he doesn't. But my baby ogre, I thrifted. Maybe org. Actually, yeah, not org, ogre. Christmas PJs that I got from Walmart for my baby. More pajamas that we're saving for the next baby. My thrifted little friend here. Does anybody know his name? Name is Gandalf the Grey. Love Lord of the Rings. A garbage pail kid. A pair of short pants, 12 month pants, short. Ha ha. What is this outfit? Six month, three to six month clothes that never got to be worn that could be very gender neutral. From Cloud Island, they'll have tags on them. So right now the piles are donate, keeps but are not clothes, keeps that are not clothes that are too big for him, and then all the clothes are too big for him that we're keeping. Okay. These I honestly really don't like. These are 12 months. These pants. Can get rid of those. I still need G-H-I-Q-T-U-V-X and Y. Shirt. The box got a little squished, but I got this from the thrift store near Daddy's sister for a whole five duars, do hairs. I don't usually collect stuff like that, but I think it's cute for five do hairs. Do hairs. Another shirt, another one that I got for baby. That's too small now. Because as soon as this pile is full, I think I'm gonna be done. As soon as that pile's gone. Or as soon as, well, as soon as I finish that. I am not doing good on this anymore. My son used to fit in these once upon a time. My son was creamy. And depending on the brand, you need to be how we fit him. Shoes I put off to the side because I have to find the matches before I can decide if I'm keeping them or getting rid of them. Generally, I keep them unless they're in really crappy condition. I'm hard pressed to get rid of them. Unless they're in really crappy condition. In really crappy condition. This all is too big. So we have a fake crack that I need to find a, another shoe for. I think I got for the big kids. They never wore. <sighs> Most of these clothes are not the right size. I did find about half a one of the class drawers full of size nine months clothes, which is good. Here is a Ash and Drake doll that Daddy got me for my birthday one year. She, I love her because she glows in the dark. I want the new one. There's another alien, big alien, and I ha don't have the full sets of the. I don't have any of the newest set of little aliens. I don't have any of the full set of the other one. I have the first two in the series, but love her, love her, love her. Because if you don't know, something you know about me probably is I love fantasy dolls. 
Okay, let's see. 4T. So I'm finding six months. So I have size six to go upstairs for our middle S. Size 10 to go up for our old S. And then nine months for our little S. Friend. Whew. 12 months. Ugh. Reborn clothes. Probably gonna fail this challenge, quite frankly. Two size threes, three T. I still have so many letters I need. Six to twelve. That can go upstairs. I don't remember where I got this troll, but he's a Niform, or Norfin, sorry, not Niform, Norfin troll. From, these are original from Norway. I do have one that has a original tag on it. It's got Norwegian on it that I think I thrifted. Four or five. Those are going to not fit him. Bye. Okay. I'm really trying to be more selective about what I get rid of and what I keep. Or, sorry, not what I get rid of, but what I keep. I'm trying to be more selective. Don't get rid of things you think you're going to regret getting rid of. Don't keep things you think, oh, maybe one day I'll use this. Unless it's like a special occasion. I have this one dress upstairs in my closet that I need to get rid of. Because I've had it for over 10 years and never worn it. it makes me so sad that I've never worn it. But it's time to get rid of it. Like, I've never worn it. And I got it probably when I was like... 15, 16, so I don't even know if it still fits me. Ugh. One of my fuglier dolls. I'm not getting rid of the, my current ones for the most part, and I'm not getting new ones. Stop collecting fugliers. That was, I think, one of my first ones, I believe. Here's this other shoe. I bought these cups again after I got rid of them all. And honestly, I don't know if I want to keep them. Because what am I realistically going to do with them? This is what they look like. And they have like the light up base for the bottom. I don't know. Maybe I'll keep them. Till we get a place and I see what space I have. Forty. Do I have this dress that I don't think I'm ever going to fit into again? And I'm pretty sure it's missing one of the buttons. This is from Wish. So I'm going to get rid of this. We have 
Strider Cup. First one was Bilbo. Right? Frodo, sorry, not Bilbo. I get confused. Frodo Baggins. Baggins. Bilbo. It's the uncle. Making a dent, guys. We're making a dent. This has some staining on it, so we're getting rid of this as well. But I think I'm about to be done here because I really have to go to the bathroom. I'm getting lightheaded because I haven't eaten barely anything today. I think I'm just going to work on putting the rest of this stuff in this bin. And then I'll be done for today. I did find a good chunk of clothes for Gabe. I didn't complete the alphabet. I missed G H I K N Q T U V X and Y. That's what I missed. But I do have a whole bag of stuff to get rid of. I already donated a bag of stuff today. Morning. So yeah. I think that's pretty much how this is gonna go. I'm gonna clean up this space. So there's walking room to get over to do laundry. And that's gonna be that for today. So bye for now, guys.